Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today we've got some more FCS South Tournament action as the Gardner Webb running Bulldogs travel to take on the North Carolina Central Eagles in round two, game three. Eagles on offense first, play action. Davis rolling out left side, gonna chuck it up and he's got Thomas open, jukes a man out. One man to beat and he is gonna carry a man into the end zone for an NC Central touchdown to start off this ball game. 54 yard touchdown, bomb. How did these teams get here, you ask? Well, round one, Gardner-Webb beat Campbell 49 to 21, and North Carolina Central beat Davidson 42 to 35 to advance to round two. Should be an interesting matchup, both high scoring teams. Let's see who will come out on top. Pendleton looking to throw, he chucks it up deep, and that was good coverage, but the receiver squeezed past the defensive back and made a nice catch for a big game. Second and 10. Pendleton rolling out right side, chucks it left, caught, and Dorsey's going to get taken down inside the five-yard line, but it is called back on a clipping penalty. That'll drop him back to the 32-yard line instead of the four. That stalled out their drive. Eagles are back on offense, looking to get some more points on the board. Davis rolling left, and a lot of green grass in front of him. I don't know if anyone is going to catch this young man, and they won't. He is gone to the house terrible defense not a defender in sight on the left side of the field 68 yard touchdown run by the quarterback Eagles back on offense again they're up 14 to nothing Davis has all day to throw it he's got Clark open on the left past midfield past the 40 gets a block still going and out of bounds at the 19 yard line Robbie Davis putting on a show for the Eagles the perfect route and pass. Safety did not have enough speed to catch up. Gets a nice block by the other receiver right there. First and 10 on the 19 yard line. Play action. Davis rolling right, throwing right to Wiley, who's got it inside the 10. Jukes, and he's got the pylon, and he's got six. Eagles are running away with it here in the first half. 21 to nothing over the Gardner Webb running Bulldogs. See if the Bulldogs can get something going here. McNeil, play action, rolling out right side. He is the third string quarterback who's now getting some playing time. And he'll get a carry for a good chunk of yards. Close to midfield. He's gonna go play action here. Pump fakes, all day to throw it. Throws it up and is caught by Dorsey who gets big hit at the 18 yard line. There was three receivers and one defender and the defender ended up winning the battle after the catch. Second and 13 from the 21 yard line. McNeil all day to throw it again. Rolling, throws it wide open is Jackson for the touchdown. The running Bulldogs get on the board finally. 21 to seven, great blocking by the O-line. And that ball was just over the fingertips of the defender. Very wobbly pass. Eagles on offense, play action. Davis going deep, wants it all, and Clark's got it, and the defender whiffs, and Clark is gonna go all the way for an easy North Carolina Central Eagles touchdown. 70-yard touchdown pass. Robbie Davis having himself a day. And I feel so bad for that defender. He just misjudged the ball, and Clark was gone as soon as he caught it. Pretty good pressure by the linebackers on a blitz, but they didn't get there in time. Bulldogs, sorry, the running Bulldogs on to punt the ball. They go three and out, they kick it deep. And that's Hutchinson who gets a couple blocks past the 40, past the 30, and the punter actually makes the tackle at the 21 yard line. Great play. Runner Bulldogs get the ball back. Eagles had to punt it away. There's 10 seconds left. Jackson has the catch up to the 37 yard line. Six seconds to go here in the first half. Got enough time for maybe a Hail Mary here. McNeil's gonna take off and he gets out of bounds with one second left so he gets another play for his team. He's gonna have to throw it 53 yards to the end zone but he throws it well short and that pass is almost caught. That was deflected about 20 times. 
North Carolina Central Eagles go into the half with a 28-7 lead over the running Bulldogs of Gardner-Webb. Nice throw to Dorsey, out of bounds at the 34-yard line. Lonnie McNeil, third-string quarterback, is doing pretty well for himself since he entered the ball game. And he's going deep this time. He's picked off by Hayden at the 14-yard line. And the Eagles are going to get back to work on offense. Wiley is wide open, and Davis throws it up to him, and he's got it. And midfield, jukes a guy out. One defender giving chase, and I'm not sure if he's going to get him, and he won't. He dove for the feet and couldn't get there. 85-yard touchdown pass to the halfback. It's now 35-7. As Robinson gets a carry left side for the running Bulldogs and breaks a tackle. Nice stiff arm. McNeil going to the air. Dorsey wide open. And he jukes, breaks a tackle, and Dorsey's going to take this one all the way to the end zone for a Gardner-Webb touchdown. This game is not out of reach yet for them. They've still got a shot to make this a ball game. If they keep making plays like that, you might see a big comeback. 35-14. Running Bulldogs need to play some defense, though, as Davis rolls left side. He's got Hutchinson wide open, but instead he throws it to the middle. Wiley's got it, and he's got blockers, and he is gone again. The running back putting on a show catching the ball. It's now 42 to 14. Gardner Webb in trouble, and they throw a pick. They did not need that. There's a flag for holding. That will be declined, and the Eagles will take back over on offense from the 35-yard line. They go on the ground to Wiley, who Jukes gets in the open field, past the 20. Jukes again up to the 18-yard line and tack on a personal foul face mask penalty. Inside the 10-yard line now, Davis. Throws the left side. Wiley's got another one, and they strip the ball from him and recover it. Coleman scoops it up, and he gets it all the way up to the 35-yard line. Nice return on the fumble recovery. One of the few highlights for the Gardner-Webb running Bulldogs on defense today. But it's still down by four touchdowns. McNeil going deep, and he's got Payne to the 33-yard line. His first catch of the half. McNeil to the air again, but he is sacked at the 42-yard line. Seven hurries, two sacks, and two picks for this Eagles defense. McNeil over the middle, picked off again. This time it's Burton, and I don't think anyone is going to catch him. He is going to have a pick six all the way to the house, untouched. 49-14, to 14, North Carolina Central on top, looking like they're going to run away with this victory and advance to round three. But the run Bulldogs are not done. They go on the ground here past the 30, the 40, and out of bounds at the 45-yard line. Robinson has 20, 34 yards on five carries. Neil pump fakes, and he is crushed. That is West's first sack of the game, 15-yard loss. Eagles back on offense. Wiley cutting it to the outside, and he fumbles it again, and it is recovered once again by Gardner-Webb. That's his second fumble of the game. But can Gardner-Webb capitalize on it? He's got Payne wide open and throws it to him. He's got him and needs a block. He gets the block, tightrope act on the sideline, and Payne is off to the races and gone. If they had done this all game, we would definitely see a different score on that scoreboard. 81-yard touchdown pass. Back on offense again late here in the game. McNeil throws it up, and it is caught by Wade down to the 30-yard line. Look at the offense. 415 yards for Gardner-Webb, 500-plus for North Carolina Central as the Eagles get another sack and a turnover on downs. Just over a minute to go. The Eagles punt the ball away, and this will be returned by Payne. And he's going to go left side, gets a couple blocks. The punter is the only one in front of him, and the punter whiffs on the tackle attempt. If you want to call that an attempt, touchdown Bulldogs, 49-28, backups now in for the Eagles, Darlington jukes a man out, and he is going to use his speed to get into the end zone for another Eagles touchdown, just pouring it on, 52-yard touchdown run for the backup halfback. That poor safety, still looking for his shoes. On the ensuing kickoff. 
Eagles kick it deep to the right side of the field. And that is Atkins from the goal line. Gets the return. Bumps into his own man. Keeps going past the 40. Past midfield. And he has one man to beat. And he does beat him. And he is gone. Touchdown Gardner Webb running Bulldogs. 100 yard return on the kickoff. And they go for two here. And they do get it. Down by 20 points now with 31 seconds to go. Eagles get the ball back after a failed onside kick attempt. And Parker, the third string halfback, breaks loose and gets out of bounds at the 23-yard line. And he's going to get up and taunt this running Bulldogs defense who has just had a really rough game tonight. He didn't even need his fullback to block. He just used his speed to get to the outside. And that is going to do it here in North Carolina as the North Carolina Central Eagles come away with a victory over the Gardner Webb running Bulldogs. 56 to 36. The Eagles advance to round three, and they will travel to take on the Savannah State Tigers. That should be a good matchup. Both of those schools are historically black college universities. Looking forward to that one. I will see you with that one sometime soon. Well, that's going to do it for this video, guys. I'll let you take a look at the stats. And I'll see you later on in the week. Take it easy, guys.